French children will have to leave their smartphones and smart devices at home or switched off when they are at school starting in September. The ban on smartphones as well as other kinds of Internet-connected devices, such as tablets, applies to schoolchildren between 3 and 15 years of age, and was passed by lawmakers on Monday. French high schools, or lycées, with students 15 and older, will get to choose whether to adopt the phone ban for their pupils. We know today that there is a phenomenon of screen addiction, the phenomenon of bad mobile phone use. Our main role is to protect children and adolescents. It is a fundamental role of education, and this law allows it, said Education Minister Jean-Michel Blanca on French news channel BFM TV. The law fulfills one of President Emmanuel Macron's campaign promises. It passed 62 votes to one supported by members of Macron's centrist La République en March party. Some lawmakers from the right and the left abstained, claiming the law would change little. This isn't a 21st century law in our eyes, but a law from the era of news channels and binary debate, said Alexis Corbier, a deputy from the left-wing Unbowed France party and a former teacher. In reality, the ban has already been made, he added referring to a 2010 law. I don't know a single teacher in this country that allows the use of phones in class. High school students with their smartphones and tablet computers at the vocational school in Bichela, eastern France. A law approved in 2010 banned the use of smartphones during all teaching activity. The new law makes exceptions for disabled students, during extracurricular activities and for pedagogical use. This is your brain on a smartphone. Our increasing dependence on smartphones has given rise to the term nomophobia, or no mobile phone phobia, the fear of not being able to use your cell phone or other smart device. One survey from the UK showed that 66% of respondents have some form of nomophobia and 41% of those respondents said they had two or more phones in order to stay connected. And as rates of smartphone and internet addiction rise, so too do the adverse effects of these activities on our brains. A study from South Korea conducted on teenagers with internet and smartphone addiction demonstrated that their brains had higher levels of a neurotransmitter that slows down neurons, resulting in reduced levels of control and attention and rendering people more susceptible to distractions. Another study by the London School of Economics and Political Science showed that banning smartphones in schools caused a clear improvement in students' test scores. More than 90% of French children between the ages of 12 and 17 had mobile phones in 2016, up from 72% in 2005, according to French telecoms regulator ARCEP. Thanks for watching. What did you think of this video? Let us know in the comments section below. You can also subscribe for more videos like these in your inbox. Now if you are seeking the latest trends in fashion, and electronics and gifts and more of the coolest things that you never knew existed at the best prices, please feel free to visit www.atthesmall.com Once again that is www.atthesmall.com If you are seeking the best in facial and clear skin regiments and products for women and men including an opportunity to earn residual income, please visit our partner at www.jdro.my rnf.com, all links are in the description box below. Share this video with your friends and family. Since you're watching, we have a small favor to ask. More people are viewing our videos more than ever but advertising revenues across the media are falling fast. And unlike many news organizations, we haven't put up a paywall, we want to keep our journalism as open as we can. So you can see why we need to ask for your help. Our videos and reports takes a lot of time money and hard work to produce. Our investigative reporting uncovers unethical behavior and social injustice, that helps to hold governments, companies and individuals to account. Through this we can, together, create meaningful change in the world. We do it because we believe our perspective matters, because it might well be your perspective too. For as little as one dollar, you can support us, and it only takes a minute. Thank you. Like and share this video on Facebook and Twitter if you agree. Don't forget to support this channel by clicking on the donation link down below and subscribing so you never miss any of our trending reports. What do you think about this video? Scroll down to comment below. We have changed to a new YouTube channel, the link is in the description box below. Please subscribe to the new channel, as this one will no longer have new videos and reports posted to it anymore.